What's up guys, Chudy here, and today I'm bringing you a collectibles guide for the new Gears 5 Hive Busters DLC, and in this video I'm going to show you the locations to all of the character ability upgrades, as well as the collectibles to get you the renewed not consumed achievement and the searching for answers achievement, and I'll also have timestamps down in the comments below to each chapter slash collectible if you're just looking for a specific one. So starting off after seeing that body there, we're going to drop down and the first collectible is going to be right here on this log. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, and here you're going to see the uh, condor on fire there in the distance. We just dropped down from this ledge here. So we're going to turn around and continue down this path just a little bit. And you're going to see a dead body on the ground and right next to it is going to be the next collectible. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, and now we're at the condor crash, and we're going to continue along to the right down this path here. And we're going to climb up this little uh, jump here. So make your way up here and continue along the path around to the left. And at the edge of this uh, jump right up here is going to be the next collectible. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, so we just slid down that uh crashed condor right there and you can see there's a pretty nice view here we're going to continue down the path past this propeller here and into this cave down here and the next collectible is going to be on the ground just next to my teammate right here so head down here and pick this one up all right so now we're on chapter two this is just after entering the bunker you're going to get an achievement for entering here so once you do that, head down the uh, stairs here, and the first upgrade is going to be right here on the ground. So pick that up. Alright, the next collectible is actually just after picking up that upgrade. So we're in the same area here. We're going to turn around and head back into this room here. So head in here, and you're going to see the collectible in the back here next to some lockers right here. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, in the next one, once you get to this room, you're going to see the Sanctum logo up there and some lava out the windows to the right. The collectible is going to be in this back room here on the left, so head in here and into the back room and pick up the collectible right here. All right, and this next one is just after the other, so we're going to have our teammate hack this uh, panel right here to open up a door so go ahead and have your teammate hack that and then while he's doing that we're actually going to backtrack a bit so we're going to head back the way we came and he's actually going to unlock a door for us so don't mind him he's going to hack that panel and while he's doing that we're going to turn around and head back up the way we came and this locked door on the right is now going to be unlocked so we can go ahead and head in here and the collectible is going to be in the back of the room so head in here Take a right and pick up the collectible on the table here. All right, so now we're back to the uh, little area where our teammate hacked the panel. So this door over here on the right is open. So we're gonna head into this room and we're gonna take a right and the next collectible is gonna be on the table right here. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, and after opening up that big door here, we're gonna continue forward to the next collectible. So drop down and head to the left. And you're gonna see a little like greenhouse area here. You actually have to have your teammate hack open that door. So go ahead and do that. There's gonna be some enemies in here, so clear them out. And once you do that, the collectible is gonna be in here on the back left right here on this little uh, table desk thing. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, so once you get the collectible in the uh, greenhouse area, you can actually continue along with the mission. And before you go down the elevator, there is actually gonna be a collectible in this next room. So make sure you don't go down the elevator just yet. So right here is the elevator. And we actually need to pick up the upgrade right here before we head down. So go ahead and do that. All right, and the next one is gonna be in this little like hive area. We just came through that door there, so you're gonna have to fight some enemies. So clear them out and then head down this uh, staircase here. And the collectible is gonna be in this room just on the right here. So go ahead and pick that up.
All right, so now we're in like some type of uh, cooling chamber room. We just came through that door there on the right. The game wants us to go through there. We also just cleared out a ton of enemies. So before we leave this area, we're gonna turn around and head back through this hallway here. And we're gonna pick up the collectible in the back left. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, so we're actually in that same cooling chamber room. We just continued along with the mission. The hallway that we were just in is over there. So we're going to turn around and continue along to this room here. And the upgrade's actually going to be hiding right between these boxes here. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, so now we've come to a room where we need to uh, activate the uh, controls over there to open up the door. But before we do that, we're actually going to turn around and head across this uh, kind of bridge area. And there's actually going to be a poster on the wall back here. So head back here and pick that up. All right, and now we're on chapter four, recollection. There was no collectibles in chapter three. So we just came across that bridge there. We're in some sort of a village. We're actually gonna head down this staircase here and then off to the right. And the first collectible is gonna be down here in this little building. So go ahead and pick that up. It's a upgrade. All right, so now we're back in that same exact area. This time we're gonna head up the uh, stairs here. So you can see there's the bridge we came across. We're actually gonna head up the staircase here. And then we're going to take a right into this building here. And the collectible is going to be in the room on the back left. So go ahead and pick that up. All right. And now we're in the same exact area as the other two collectibles. But this time we're actually going to go inside this house here. So head over here to this house and open up this door here. I've already opened it. So head in here and we're going to actually head to the back left. Don't open up this door just yet. We need to get this collectible. So head out here to the back and pick up this collectible right here. All right, so this one is after you picked up the last collectible, you can go ahead and open up this door here and then we're going to continue forward and down the staircase to the left here. And we're gonna head into this building here and the collectible's actually gonna be on the ground right here. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, so after picking up that upgrade, we can actually get the next collectible by heading out of this building. And we're gonna take a left and head up the stairs and turn right. And we're gonna take a left and follow along with this path. We're gonna take a right and then we're gonna head into this house here on the left side and the next collectible is going to be in here on the table so go ahead and pick that up all right and the next one is going to be in this little dining area with the statue there at the end of the hall so we're actually going to go to the right side of the room and pick up the next upgrade right here so go ahead and pick that up All right, and now we're in some sort of little market area. We just cleared out a ton of enemies. And before heading up to that house there, we're actually gonna turn to the right and go behind this big creature here. And the next collectible is gonna be back here on the ground. So go ahead and pick that up. All right, so now we're inside the uh, house at the top of the hill there, just after the last collectible. So. This next one is going to be on the table right here, so go ahead and pick that up. Alright, and the next one is going to be over here to the left side, kind of next to this waterfall. So before we head up those stairs there into that building, we're actually going to pick up the next one right here on the left. So go ahead and do that. All right, so now we're in this little courtyard area. We just fought some enemies. So before continuing along into that building there, we're actually gonna take a right and head across this little path here. And we're gonna pick up the next collectible on this ledge here. All right, so now we're in the next area. We just came through a door. So to proceed, we actually need to get in this uh, silver back here. But before we do that, we're gonna pick up this collectible here 
on this table. So go ahead and pick that one up before you continue. All right, and now we're on chapter five. I believe we just slid down a hill. So we're gonna continue along the uh, path here and you're gonna see this like big dead creature. And uh, the collectible is actually gonna be on the ground right here. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, and once you get to this room with the uh, lava here in the center, the collectible is actually going to be in the back left right here. This little statue guy is holding it, so go ahead and pick that one up. All right, so once you get to this uh, room here with the statue in the center, there's actually going to be two collectibles here, so you can actually see them both on screen. I'm going to go for the one on the right and pick up this weapon upgrade here. And once you do that, you can actually head right around to the uh, room next door and get the other collectible. So turn around, take a right, and then head into the other room here. And the other collectible is going to be right here. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, once you get out to this little uh, grassy area here, you can actually see the volcano up there in the distance. We're gonna head forward and down this little staircase here. And the collectible is actually gonna be on the left side here. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, so we just dropped down that staircase there and we're gonna uh, head inside this little building here. So head through these vines here, and there's actually gonna be two collectibles in this room. So the first one's right here on the right side, so go ahead and pick that up. And then from there, you can turn around and pick up the next one literally right behind you. So there you can see I got the achievement for getting all of the upgrades. And once you do that, turn around and pick up the little tomahawk right here. So pick that up and that'll be your next collectible. All right, and the next collectible is gonna be up here inside of this uh, ship thing or plane, whatever the hell this thing is. It's gonna be in here on the right side. So head in here and it's just inside this little case thing. So go ahead and pick that one up. All right, so now we're in this uh, jungle area with a fork in the path here. We can either go left or right. We just dropped down from that ledge there the game wants us to take the left path and continue along with the mission, but before we do that, we're actually going to turn to the right here, and we're going to pick up the last collectible of the game, so go ahead and pick that up, and you should get your achievement for collecting all of the collectibles. Shout out to my friend Blizzy for helping me find them all. So that's it guys, I hope the video was helpful. If it was, drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.